Yesterday, something really big happened in California relating to Tesla, and which is not talked about very much today. California lawmakers disagreed with Tesla. New California law efficiently banned Tesla from advertising FSD. California passed a new law banning Tesla from calling its software full self-driving. Although Tesla has never claimed that FSD was fully autonomous, the electric car maker is developing the technology for fully autonomous vehicles. Until its vehicles are fully autonomous, drivers must be alert and ready to take over at all times when engaging FSD or autopilot. This is a big news. California lawmakers, however, disagree with the labels of FSD with Tesla. Senate Bill 1398 was one of the hundreds that Governor Newsom signed into law yesterday. The new law takes effect in 2023 and specifically targets Tesla's name for its software. The bill was sponsored by Senate Transportation Committee Chair Lena Gonzalez, who claimed that Tesla falsely advertised its tech and that doing so was a safety issue. The bill was sponsored after the California Department of Motor Vehicles claimed that Tesla's FSD was false advertising. I'm about to share with you an excerpt from the bill. An excerpt from the new law reads as follows. A manufacturer or dealer shall not name any partial driving automation feature, uh, feature or describe any partial driving automation feature in marketing materials using language that implies or would otherwise lead a reasonable person to believe that the feature allows the vehicle to function as an autonomous vehicle. On its website on full self-driving capability, Tesla says that all new vehicles have the hardware needed in future for full self-driving. So what do you think? I think this is going to change the name of FSD in 2023. Tesla has time until 2023. But I think since California is a big market for Tesla, Tesla may not need to change the name of full self-driving. What do you think about this, friends? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. This is a big news affecting FSD's name in California, Tesla's largest, perhaps, US market. And let's see what happens and what Tesla will respond. I think Tesla needs a human, uh, actually, press department, somebody who could talk about these things besides Elon Musk on Twitter. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. And uh, please subscribe to our channel and give us thumbs up if you found this report useful and informative. And please uh, share in our social media, in your social media, and subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news. See you soon in our next report.